Good afternoon, I'm Jeff. I'm a Sewer Tech Northwest. Today we're at property address 692 Northwest Queens Court here in Hillsboro. We're located on the right side of the home or just outside the side entrance to the garage. We have a three inch ABS clean out as our point of access. There is no cap or flange on this. I would recommend doing that so that leaves uh, don't leaves and debris don't get in there as well as uh, if you have kids sometimes they like to throw stuff down the pipe we don't want to get it clogged up for that reason so I recommend getting a cap put on this we do have water currently running here we go Very 20 foot line of access line transitions here from 3 inch ABS. Looks like over to 6 inch concrete. And it looks like we've got a pretty significant root intrusion coming through a joint here. We'll see if we can push past it. All right, here at 60 feet out, we have reached the main lateral connection. All due locates to verify that it's out in the middle of the road. We'll let the line drain out here for a couple minutes. We have a better look at the line. We'll also uh, get that root intrusion marked for repair. Okay, located the camera head at the main. Line heads out to 7th Avenue, so the uh, road off to the side of the home. Over here at the uh, root intrusion through the line. I'm going to try and uh, locate the camera head here. 
it's hard to say if it's coming through the transition joint. It almost looks like there's part of the roots that are punching right through the sidewall. Um, but either way, I do recommend repairing this. Uh, it's filling up a m big portion of the sewer line. It could cause a, uh, back, a block up pretty easily. All right, I'm uh, picking up a locate here. I'm going to back the camera up and, and try and get a depth in a different spot. Um, there, as the line goes down the side yard here, out towards 7th, about halfway down the yard, there is an old tree stump. You can see part of the tree that's, that's busted off. Um, they, it looks like they literally planted the tree right on top of this transition joint. So I have a white marking there right where the tree stump is at. It's very easy to see. Uh, but as far as depth goes, I'm going to have to pull it back here. It's hard to locate on top of all that, uh, the tree stump and everything. All right, I just did a marking right here where the uh, transitions, transition point is at. Marked it with a white X. It's right where the uh, tree stump is at, very obvious. Uh, it's right around uh, six feet in depth here. Recommend uh, repairing the pipe. Looks like a foot or two of the concrete section here needs to be replaced. You could do that by either digging down and fixing it that way. Um, you might be able to jet the line out, get all the roots and stuff out of there and do a, a pipeline. Uh, but in no concrete over the top of it, it likely will be cheaper just to dig it up. And I recommend a uh, rescope after any repair work. Make sure that it was done properly. Either side of the root intrusion is in good shape. Well, once that root intrusion gets taken care of, we'll have a nicely functioning sewer line. I'm going to go ahead and reel the camera out. And again, uh, it'd be a good idea to get a, a cap and flange put on this. Fairly cheap to do at a Home Depot.